Welcome to video number one. I'm going to ask you to do precisely what you see me doing. Yep, you have to join along. Some of the movements may seem trivial, but it's very important you stay the course because we must give very specific commands to our central nervous system. Here we go. My feet, they are flared. My knees, they are bowed. Not pigeon-toed, not close together. Feet are flared. Knees are bowed. We are bent forward. And we are flexing our knees, viewed from another angle. Feet are flared. Knees are bowed. We are bent forward. And we are flexing our knees. How much we're bent forward kind of depends on how tall we are. Just make sure you stick your tush out a little bit and flex the knees, you'll probably be okay. But let's keep doing this. Feet are flared. This promotes pivoting instead of swaying. And it is very safe for your joints when you flare your feet. We'll talk more about this in the future. Feet are flared, knees are bowed. We are bent forward, flexing our knees, viewed from another angle. Feet are flared, knees are bowed. We are bent forward, we are flexing our knees. Yet again, feet are flared, knees are bowed. We are bent forward, we are flexing our knees. Monotonous? Yeah, I'd say so. But you need to do it over and over. You can't do it too much. Do it a little more today, tonight, tomorrow morning. If you have questions, please feel free to message me on my personal cell listed on the site. And when you're ready, join me for video number two.